Hey, welcome to the Danger Zone. It's Ashley. Lots of love and many blessings your way. Everything in my video is found on a public domain. It just seems like Megan and Harry are in competition with William and Kate now ever since they got scolded for using the private jet four times in 11 days. And they've been especially mad ever since Kate and William were photographed taking a commercial flight with their children. And it's not like William and Kate had just purchased these tickets to get back at Harry and Meghan. These things were purchased long before. Harry and Meghan boarded the first of four flights in 11 days using a private jet. Supposedly, Meghan, Archie, and Harry had a low-key lunch date at the pub, the Rose and Crown, having a down-to-earth meal of Sunday roast. Their meals were right around $18 and some change a plate. She, of course, was sucking on water. He had a couple of pints of beer with his lunch. Now, according to the eyewitness, as Harry sat there with the bodyguard, they're calling his secretary. Megan was there cradling baby Archie on her lap the entire time, trying to pick at her meal around little Archie. It was amazing. The eyewitness included this. Baby Archie was good as gold. He didn't make one sound, not one peep. He behaved so well. <laughs> they say, of course, the staff recognized them, but they wanted to keep it a low-key service. Nobody else seemed to recognize them, not in the entire pub. What a crock, you guys. Let me tell you something. Thank you to Sweet Kay and also my buddy Trish for sending me this so fast. Turns out, this was nothing more than a PR stunt set up by Harry and Meghan. So a very popular media site contacted the Rose and Crown. They wanted details. They wanted to know why they, they weren't even photographed. And guess what, you guys? The Rose and Crown said, we don't know what you're talking about. They weren't here. <laughs> Busted. Is that not gross, y'all? I'll see you soon, and we'll talk fast. Stay safe and be blessed.